Here's the new trailer for the new Beachbody program, Muscle Burns Fat. And if you do also want to try out the advanced version, click on the link up there. And I'll also leave a 14 day free trial for Beachbody On Demand in the description below. Subscribe to the channel for fitness tech and more workout programs. And don't forget to like the video if it does help you out. How do you turn your body into a 24 seven fat burning machine? Muscle. This is MBF, Muscle Burns Fat, where you can get lean, strong, and healthy in just three weeks. I'm Megan Davies, and in around a half hour a day, we're gonna do strength training and cardio set to the beat with great music that drives your pace and intensity. Seven days a week, three weeks, serious results. All you need are dumbbells and these bod ropes, the cordless indoor jump rope. This program has simple moves that are powerful that will help build strength and burn fat no matter your fitness or experience level. And when you combine it with a proven nutrition plan, you're gonna see results like this, this, and this. Super healthy, super strong. But let's not just talk about it, let's do it. And let me show you what MBF is all about. Hey guys, Megan Davies here. Welcome to the NBF Sample Workout. Now today, we're going to show you a taste of what this program is all about. So get ready for a full body burn. Now I got my Zoom team all checked in. How are you guys doing today? Hey. Yes. For the first time ever, the cast is checking in from home just like you. So I hope you guys took your Energize today because this workout is going to get real. Grab your bod ropes. Here we go. All right, so if this is the first time using these bod ropes, I want you to stay nice and light on your feet. Just find the beat, find the rhythm, all right, and have fun with them. That's what this program is all about. Now I want to introduce you to Lacey. She's going to be our modifier throughout the entire program. How you doing, Lacey? I'm doing good, Megan. Ready to work? Love it. And she always brings the energy. She's going to show you how to make this program work for you no matter what. We're going to go high knees right here. Let's drive. You can see Lacey already is driving those knees up towards her chest. She's marching it out, all right? She's taking the impact out, and you'll see her all through this program showing you exactly what to do. All right, 15 seconds. So we use these bod ropes in our cardio spikes. We use them in our cardio days. We also use them in our weight training days. So they're an important tool to this program. If you don't have them yet, air rope, we'll get it done still. End time. Bod ropes down, going to squats with an overhead reach. Follow me, reach up, squat, up and down, reach. Arms by the ears, really reach for that overhead position and then sit those hips back. We want the feet flat on the floor and back flat. Give me two more reps. We're going into side lunges next, so feet wider than shoulder width apart. Right here, sit it back. Nice and slow here. Really drive the hip back, toes facing forward. Inside leg is straight, so put energy even through that leg. Last slow one, we're gonna speed it up from here. Here we go, down and up. So you can see that the music is a huge part of the program. We'll take the tempo up, we'll slow it back down, and everything in between, all right? So feel the beat, feel that rhythm, and follow me. Excellent, let's go chest stretch. Three pulses back, swing forward. Pulse, oh, yeah. pulse, pulse, excellent job. Palms facing the ceiling, so we even get that feeling down into our biceps, and we keep the arms straight out. You guys feel that? It's like we want to give you a big hug, Megan. Exactly, I'm gonna give me a big <laughs> hug. <laughs> excellent, two more, and we're gonna go into arm circles next. Last one, excellent job. Arm circles back, reach. Full range of motion, whatever that means for you. Doing awesome. Just getting the shoulders and the chest warmed up because we do have some push-ups today, my favorite move. Reach, let's switch directions. Reach forward. Now, if you need more movement prep, meaning you need to get ready for this workout, a little bit longer, you need a little bit more stretching, a little bit more mobility, we have a movement prep 101 video that I want you to check out. Excellent job. 
All right, shake it out. We're heading into our first block. It's a weight training block. It's asymmetrical, which means you're gonna need one moderate to heavy dumbbell. I'm going to grab a 10. All right, we'll go 10. All right, so for our first exercise, we have a split squat. You're gonna hold that dumbbell in your right hand. Take a big step back with your right leg. Split squat is knee towards the floor. Stand back up to the top. Second exercise, back to back. Hinge from the hips. Two rows at a quick pace. Stand up to the top, flat back there. Third exercise, we're building, all right? Third exercise is going to be a combo. Two split squats, hinge forward, two quick rows. All right, then we'll switch sides. This is what this program's all about. Building muscle, burning fat. Here we go. Let's bring it down and up, down and up. Back knee towards the floor, keeping the chest up tall and core tight. You got this. Let's go, MBA family. Awesome job. So our weight training days are lower, our upper, our full body days. They have the same structure. Asymmetrical blocks, you'll see another different sort of block next. All right, but you'll always see the same structure. Give me four more. And three. Going into those rows. Two. Last split squat, hinging from the hip. Right here. Hinge. Two rows. Squeeze behind that shoulder blade. Hinge. Two rows. Stand up to the top. Now that leg out in front. You should feel that birdie, booty starting to burn. <laughs> Two rows. <laughs> this program is the first of the cast at home, just like you. And we have an awesome cast. They bring the energy every single workout, so thank you guys. Hit. Woo. Nice job. One more, and we're heading into that combo. Two split squats. Here we go. Down and up. Down. Keep those legs moving. We got this. Hinge. Two rows. And stand. Again. Excellent. We're going through this combo four times. We're already halfway through. Two rows. Two more times through. Nice. So asymmetrical work. We load one side of our body. You're going to find your core has to engage a lot more when you only have one dumbbell in your hand. A dumbbell is going to pull you over to one side. Don't let it. Keep your core tight. Hinge. Two rows, your last one, and stand. I don't know about you, but my booty is burning from that one. Other side, straight into it, split squats. Four, three, two, one. Down, and up, down, and up. Get low, guys. Awesome job. Work through that burn. Stay with me. One rep at a time. I want you to challenge that range of motion. Try to get nice and low. Keeping this back hip open, you want to keep the chest nice and tall. Think about your body as a whole as you do each move. Four more. Almost there. Nice work. Two more. Head into hinge to row. Here we go. Right here. Hinge. Two rows. And stand. Hinge. Two rows. We got this. Woo! Now normally we do two sets, so we would go back to the right side. Today, it's a sample, so we're only gonna do one set on each side. So get ready in the regular program to really work through this burn. These asymmetrical blocks have a lot of volume to them, which means a lot of reps. In the next block, we'll go a little bit heavier. We'll take down the reps. Last one, heading into combo. Two split squats. Here we go. Bring it down and up. Down and up. One hinge. Hinge, two rows. Stand up strong. Nice. Nice. Good job, y'all. Yes. Yes. Guys are doing awesome. Jennifer is always killing it. She has amazing Thank form. You, yes. I notice every day. Bring the heat. And up. Last time. Down. And up. Down. Excellent job. Last row. Two rows. And up to the top. Nice. Dumbbell comes down. Bod ropes come up. Get ready. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Go. All right. So this is the time that we spike that heart rate up. Your heart rate's not up already. I want you sprinting all out effort. All right. Especially in our leg day, our heart rate is already up. All right. But we use these jump ropes a lot to really start getting that burn, to get that calorie burn so we can get the results that we're looking for. 
Even though this program, we prioritize weight training, we still have some cardio in there. Everybody gets a little something. Knees up. Start picking up that pace. All right. So we have somebody special in this group. That is Michelle. She was part of my test group. How much weight did you lose, Michelle? Oh, my God, that was 20 pounds and 19 inches everywhere. I love it. She lost 20 pounds, absolutely killed the test group. I'm so, so proud of her. She did this with nutrition and the workout. Last couple seconds. Time. Awesome job. Bod ropes down, guys. Heading into our next weight training block. A little bit different. We're going to grab a pair of dumbbells. All right, I'm going to grab my 10s. Coming down to the floor, we have two exercises. 30 seconds, eat your knees, palms forward. Get ready. Three, two, one. Bring it up, down to the side. Excellent. Elbows stuck in by rib cage the entire time. Make sure you're unlocking those elbows to the bottom of the move. And this is it, guys. Muscle burn fat. Building the muscle to raise our metabolism up. You guys got this. You want those results? This is how we do it. Up and control. Walk back out to push-ups. Weights down. Push-up position. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Down. And up. Woo! Make the chest and shoulders work for it. You guys got this. Keep your core tight. Keep your booty tight. Keep your legs tight. That's how we're going to walk their body into position here. Down, nice and slow. And up. Woo, last one. And up to the top. Awesome. W curls. Walk back. Get set up. In four, three, two, one. Let's go up. Nice. So I'm a stickler for these moves, especially those push-ups. So if you need a little bit of help on forming the technique, we got a video for that. I'm going to help you out because I want to see you get the most out of this program. So check out the form video that we have. It's some of the bonus content. Last one, up and down. Excellent. One more set, guys. Stay with me. How you feeling? Four, three, two, one. Down and up. Now, dropping into the mod is perfectly fine. I want you to do as many reps as you can and then modify out so we can keep the tension on those muscles. I'd rather you modify and keep moving. Two more. Down. That control is everything. Stay on that beat is everything. And up. Excellent. Walk it back. W curls. Palms facing forward. Four. Three. We got this. Two. And one. Bring it up. Control. Wide. Nice. Loving the form I'm seeing. Good. Squeeze. So we want to challenge those muscle fibers. All right, the more they work, we're actually breaking down muscle, all right, when we're working out. It's the time that we're resting, getting that good nutrition in, and we're actually building up stronger. Last one, down. Awesome job. All right, weights down. Bob ropes up. Four, three, two, one, let's go. All right, guys. Now's the time. Once again, we hit this cardio spike. All right, so in our normal program, we would do the asymmetrical block, the regular block, and we'd have two more blocks after that. Each block ends with that cardio spike. Three days a week, our upper, our lower, our full body. All right, so you're gonna be using these body ropes a lot. We're gonna <laughs> check out the cardio and core section next. Halfway, let's go, knees up. When I say knees up, I want you to start sprinting towards that finish line. You have less than 30 seconds to go in this spike, so I really want you to drive it home with everything you got. 15 seconds, push. Nice job. Mackenzie, I see you killing it. Keep it up. Yes, Mackenzie's always bringing it. Last second. Time. Love it. All right, keep your body ropes in your hand. <laughs> All right, so we're heading into our cardio block, which is part of our core circuit days on Tuesdays and Thursdays. All right, our cardio block, we're going to do three exercises, two rounds back to back. First exercise, regular jump rope, pushing through the toes. Second exercise, grab those bod ropes into your hand with a firm grip so they're not flailing around. Second exercise, drop into that lunge, up and together. Drop and up. Third exercise, my favorite. 
sledgehammer, through, twist, and through. Get ready for jump rope. Here we go. Woo! Deep breath. Two, one. Guys. So we use the jump ropes to maximize our heart rate, our fat burn, get the best results possible during this program. So I want you to find a rhythm, find a good pace, shoulders down away from the ears, wrist flick down by your hips. It's gonna create that motion, but they don't wanna be propellers either. Nice. <laughs> Grab those bod ropes. Here we go. In four, three, two, one. Bring it down and up. Down and up. Nice. Check out Lacey's modification. She's bringing it down into a reverse lunge. She's taking out the jump. She's still getting yeah. her heart rate up. And if I can oh, tell yeah. you, if anybody's working hard, Lacey, she keeps the energy up. Two more. Flight hammer. Here we go. Down and through. Down. Through. Let that inner leg rotate. You got it. Bring it through. Keep your core tight. Rotate. You got this. Nice. So we use these cardio exercises to build our AMRAP finishers. We're going to talk about that in just a second. So I want to finish these flush hammers. Getting ready for jump rope. Here we go. Woo. Jump rope. All right. So AMRAP means as many rounds as possible. So we're going to take some of these moves from our cardio block, pull it into our AMRAP and try to beat our score week to week. So it's gonna be a challenge, but I know you guys are up for that challenge. All right, it's a lot of fun. You won't check them out in this program, but you'll see them when we get into our first core circuit day. Grab those bottom ropes, here we go. Down and up. Keep with me. Now the format is the same for our core circuit workouts on Tuesday and Thursday. A little bit of jump rope. One of the movements, back to back. You got it, how you guys feeling? Four more. Get ready for sledgehammer. Last one, sledgehammer, let's go. Through, down, through. Energy coming through the center. Let's go guys, down, through, down, through. Let's go guys, I wanna see it. Here we go, down, good. MJ Michael. Push each other. Tell each other you can get a little bit more. Come on. You push. Ha. You fight. Ha. You win. Ha. You don't. Last one. Time. Woo. Awesome job. Bad ropes come down. Awesome job. Let's come down to the floor. Four exercises in our core round. First one, bicycles. Elbow to opposite knee. Center. Same thing on the other side, keeping the shoulder blades up. Second move, hollow body hold. Arms by the ears, modified arms by the sides, modified more, knees in. Third exercise, flip over, mountain climbers, knees into the chest. Fourth exercise, skydivers, knees out, hands by the ears. Getting ready, bicycles, here we go. Three, two, one. Cross and center. Nice job. Make sure you come back to center. Check out Lacey's modification. Feet are on the ground. She's still rotating through the core. Lower back stays on the floor. Nice. Squeeze. Yes. <laughs> you guys are doing awesome. Last one each side. And then hold here. Oh, this one's gonna be tough. It's 30 second hold. Now you also have on the go workouts that I want you to check out. If you're ever traveling, they're a great option to make sure if you don't have any weights or equipment or anything like that, that you can still get oh, it yeah. done. If you need to modify, hands down. You need to modify further, knees in. And then you kind of control that modification from here. The further out your legs are, the harder it's going to be. Last couple seconds. Hold it with me. Nice. Let's roll. Over to mountain climber position. Four, three, two, one. Drive it in. Shoulders over the wrist. Straight line through the body. Let those legs float underneath you. Keep the core tight. Pull the belly button in towards the spine. Modified movement. March it out. Keep it moving. You got this. Breathe and work. Good. Let's lower. Knees out. 
Arms up in four, three, two, let's go. Bring it up, down, up and down. Squeeze in the glutes, squeeze in the lower back. Let the glutes help your lower back. You want to activate right there. We got it. Last couple reps, and then we have another round. Don't forget. Up and down. Flip over. One more time through. Starting with the bicycles. Four, three, two, one. Cross, center, cross, center. So I'm hitting the modification right now. Come down with me if you need to. Awesome. We also have, if you love core work, I know a lot of you do, we have bonus 10 minute workouts that are just core. You can add to any day. Last one on each side. Hollow body hold, hold. Hold it here. Lower back pressing into the floor. If you feel your lower back start to arch up off the ground, that indicates we need to come down to a modified position. Reposition, pull your lower back in. Knees bent. Nice. Almost there. We're getting ready for mountain climbers. Last couple seconds here. Deep breath in. In four, three, two, one. Let's flip it over. Push your position, high plank position. Four, three, two, one. Let's drive. Now, we might do a lot of core work, but that doesn't always mean we're gonna see the results. Because you've ever heard the expression, after made in the kitchen, I mean it. All right, so our nutrition has to be on point. We need ultimate portion fits. We need 2B mindset. So pick one of those programs. Make sure you get set up with it. Nice. Low down. Knees out, hands up. In four, three, two, one. Bring it up, down, up, and down. Squeeze, activate the booty. Lower back is working. I know, we all want the booty games. Up and down. Last couple reps, almost done with this core block. Two more. Last one. Woo! Done. All right. Now we have our last part of our workout up on your feet. Grab a sip of water. So, heading into our EMOM, it's our Saturday workout. Every minute on the minute. I'm gonna give you an exercise, a certain number of reps to do. At the top of each minute we start. You do it as fast as possible, and your rest time is that time in between when you finish and the next minute. I cut you off at 40 seconds, no matter what. The move today is going to be thrusters. Weights at the shoulders, feet shoulder width apart. Squat down, power up above your head. Drag it down into the next rep. You have 15 reps every minute on the minute. You guys ready for this? Yes, we are. Woo, all right. Weights at the shoulders, hold on to them with a firm grip. Getting ready, feet shoulder width apart. 15 reps here in four, three, two, one. Go, you heard that little noise. That little noise, it reminds me of like Mario. I want you to start and end at that little noise. All right, you guys got it. 15 reps. Squat lower. Nice job, Gianna. Gianna's getting low in those squats. If you can get as low as Gianna, that's what I want to see. She's still powering up to the top of that movement. Breathe and work, guys. Keep track of those reps. Nice job. When you're done, weights can come down. If you're not done yet, you have a couple more seconds to finish. 40 seconds right here, rest. No matter what, even if you're not done with your rest, I want that work to rest ratio. Getting ready for round two. Dumbbells in hand. Same thing, 15 reps. Wait for that noise. Hands at the shoulders, feet shoulder width apart. Deep breath in, control that heart rate. Here we go. Let's go. All right, so Esteban was another person in our test group who had amazing results. And if you can breathe right now, Esteban, what were those results? I'll try. It's I lost over 11 pounds and gained a bunch of muscle, especially for my life. Yes, he lost a lot, over 11 pounds. He gained so much muscle. Esteban got absolutely shredded. You should check out those results. He did amazing. Again, working hard every day and nutrition. That's what it's all about. Weights down when you're done. All right. I'm gonna cut you off at that 40 second mark. 
time. Rest, 20 seconds. Now this is our Saturday power night workout. 25 minutes. Get in, get out, all right? We have three more rounds of these thrusters. We got this. Deep breath in. It goes fast and furious. Spike your heart rate. Grab those dumbbells. Get ready. Let's go. Third round. This is the middle round. When we start thinking we should back down, don't back down. Stay with me. Never back down. Breathe and work. You guys are sweating with me. I'm working right alongside you. All right? Keep the pace. Whatever that pace is for you. Lacey's modifying. She's not getting down so low. And she's using lighter weights. All right? And that's a modification for a lot of this program. Woo! Over the hump, guys. Over the hump. All right. So you also have, if I can breathe, the Get Started Guide. You're going to have your calendar. You're going to track your AMRAPs in here. You're also going to track your measurements in here. So check this puppy out. All right. Get ready for the next round. Deep breath in. Care of your weight. Two more rounds. Here we go. I'm ready to go with you, mate. Let's go. Round four out of five. We got this. Now in the program, you're also gonna have a weight tracker sheet. You can always track your progress. I want you to meet or beat your reps, your rounds, whatever that may be every single week. So we need to track in order to know where we're going. That's how we keep building muscle, burning fat. It's challenging ourselves every single week. Woo! Come on, y'all. Put those weights down when you're done. Walk it out, 40 seconds. Time, rest, no matter what. One more round, guys. Almost done. You guys with me? Bear with me. All right. Last 15 reps of the day, and then we cool down. Grab those dumbbells. Let's go. Last 15. Everything you got. Nice. So you have Lanier, you have Christina that are together. All right, they're challenging each other every single day. If you don't have a partner at home, then you always have bod groups. You always have Team Beach Body. So make sure that you're taking advantage of those. Awesome job, guys. Uh, I can barely breathe. One rep at a time. Get it done. Finish. Jennifer, I see you. Mish, Mackenzie, you guys are doing awesome. Breathe. Melissa, you rocking today. Matt, holler. Woo. You got it, Ari. You're killing it, too. I see you. Thank you. Last couple seconds. Finish strong, guys. Deep breath in. If you're done, you're recovering. Woo! And time. Awesome job, guys. I need a second to catch my breath. <laughs> but now, we're gonna go into mobility flow, which is our Sunday workout. It's 25 minutes long as well. And we need to open up all of those places that we work during the week. It's just as important to you as any other workout. So make sure you don't skip mobility and stretching day. I know we like to. Come down to the floor, child's pose first. Sit it back, arms reaching forward. Concentrate on your breathing. Push your chest down to the floor. Really reach these fingertips in front of you. Arms straight. Ooh. Focus on your breathing here. I know I need to. Whew. All right, we're gonna come up to cat-cow. So up to a tabletop position. Hands underneath the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. Reach up, hips under. Reach down, hips up, head up. And repeat. Down and out, focus on your breathing. Focus on moving your spine and your hips. And out. And up. Let's walk it out into more of a plank position. Walk the hands out. Let the hips come forward through that plank into a cobra. Chest up, push the hands down into the floor so your shoulders are down and away from the ground. Or sorry, are down and away from your ears. Oh, I'm still breathing too heavy to think. <laughs> Let the hips come down. 
We're gonna come up into downward dog next. So we're just gonna push the hips straight up into the air. Come up. Arm straight, leg straight. Let the hips sink down towards the floor. I'm gonna scoot back a little, get fit, because my hands are sliding in my sweat. <laughs> Drive the hips up. Let's bring one heel down. Other heel can stay up. Hold it here for a second. Other side. Other heel comes down. Hold it here for a second. We're gonna flow, coming down into our child's pose first. Knees down, hips back. Come close to the ground, chest towards the floor, up into that cobra position. And then come back up into downward dog. Hold here for a second, let's repeat. Bring it down, into child. Nice and low to the ground, into cobra. And then up into downward dog. Nice, excellent. Bring those knees down. A little bit of a stretch here. Arms up overhead. Last couple of deep breaths into the bottom of your lungs. And exhale slowly. Nice. A couple more of those deep cleansing breaths. I heard somebody breathing. That's what I want to hear. Awesome job. Release. All right, the sweat is pouring right now, guys. Come on up. So it is important to recover after each of these exercises. So make sure that you now take that beach body, recover, all right? So how you guys feel? How'd you do today? I love it. Oh my God, it's literally dripping. <laughs> well, guys did awesome today. I want you to review the Get Started Guide because it's going to give you all the information you could possibly need for getting started in this program. So make sure you take those first steps. Also, review the uh, Intro to Nutrition and Beachbody Supplements videos. It's going to tell you all you need to know about To Be Mindset, about Ultimate Portion Fix, and about all the Beachbody Performance Supplements that are so important to your progress. So do your day one photos. I know sometimes we don't want to, but we want to make sure we're measuring more than just what the scale is telling us. We want to see those progress photos as well. So contact your Team Beachbody coach to get started with this program. Make sure you share your journey with me, guys. I can't wait to see it. Bye, guys. Awesome job today. Thank you so much, Megan.